91.3 FM, WBNY Buffalo, Buffalo's original alternative since 1982. You just heard Reel Around the Fountain by the Smiths. Before that, Colleen Green with Close to You, and now it's time to announce some sad news. Drummer and vocalist of Husker Du, Grant Hart, passed away after a battle with cancer on Thursday. He was 56 years old. Hart was born in St. Paul, Minnesota on March 18, 1961 and went on to form Husker Du with Bob Mould and Greg Norton in 1979. The Huskers were ultimately one of the first bands to bridge the gap between hardcore punk and emotional melodic rock and released several esteemed albums including the Metal Circus EP, New Day Rising, and my personal favorite, as you probably know, Zen Arcade. I read somewhere that Husker Du was a band from the 1990s stuck in 1983. I think it was on the punk subreddit. I could be wrong, though. Um, but I mean, that quote just resonates. That's how influential they were to the next decade of music. You know, they did not get the recognition they deserved at the time, but I mean, the influence that they left, the legacy, incredible. And as some of my regular listeners may know, Husker Du is and probably forever will be one of my favorite bands. I play them just about every show and as cliche as it sounds, I can't imagine what my life would be like if I hadn't listened to Zen Arcade for the first time at all. A personal anecdote, when I came to Buffalo last year, like many college freshmen, I felt out of place, alone. And it was early February, and one day I found myself on the west side, just wandering about. I had no destination in mind. I was just walking. I was just listening to music and walking. And somehow I ended up walking towards the Niagara River and ended up on the Bird Island Pier and... I just kept walking and walking, and keep this in mind, it was a frigid February day, and here I am, on this little pier in the river, the waves kept lapping onto the causeway, my feet were getting wet, um, it was soaking through my shoes, and the wind was bone chilling, like you could not breathe, it was so cold, and my hands were, they were purple, it was that freezing out, and somehow, it was, you know, one of those things... You don't know how it happens. It was a pure coincidence, but it just happened. Standing by the sea came on through my headphones. At that moment, I was near the Peace Bridge. You know, the water was coming over, and, you know, I couldn't breathe. It was so cold. And then you just hear the bass of Standing by the Sea coming through my headphones. And it couldn't have been a more perfect moment. And it's one of those little inconsequential moments that just sticks with you forever. It was that sublime. It was just amazing. Myself and the crew here at uh, WBNY would like to offer our condolences to the Hart family, as well as Bob Mould, Greg Norton, and all those who have been touched by Grant's music. Um, I mean, I, I, I think that the music that they made was just some of the most influential and great music, you know, that we've been blessed with, and I'm just so happy to have been able to discover it and to find it. And, you know, as sort of a tribute to Grant, the remainder of my show will be four of my favorite Grant song Husker Du tracks. Pink Turns Blue from Zen Arcade, Girl Who Lives in Heaven Hill from New Day Rising, Turn on the News from Zen Arcade, and Don't Want to Know If You Are Lonely from Candy Apple Gray. This show, The Weekend Warm-Up, has been dedicated in the memory of Grant Hart. Thank you for your contributions to some of the finest music that was ever made. Please be sure to tune in next week at 5 here on 91.3 FM, WBNY, Buffalo's original alternative since 1982. This is Ryan signing off, and this is Husker Du. These are for you, Grant.